Hello everybody, I am Betsy Smith, President and CEO of the Central Park Conservancy. And I am Yeshem Phillip, President of the Central Park Conservancy's Women's Committee. Welcome to the 24th Annual Central Park Holiday Lighting, which this year is a virtual reimagining of our special event. The Central Park Conservancy has the honor of caring for the entire park, a beloved public space that serves as New York City's backyard. Conservancy staff expertly tend to the largest and smallest details of the park's maintenance and restoration, ensuring it remains welcoming, clean, and beautiful for our 42 million yearly visitors. This year in particular, Central Park has become more valuable and meaningful than ever, and all of us at the Conservancy take great pride in our work so that all visitors can find sanctuary within its 843 acres. Tonight, we celebrate not only the holidays, but also the great communities surrounding and supporting us throughout this challenging year. I want to take this opportunity to thank our host, the Women's Committee of the Central Park Conservancy, represented today by their president, Yeshem Phillip. The leadership and vision of this impressive group of women has made this magical event possible year after year. Thank you, Betsy. Tonight's event is brought to us through the extraordinary generosity of our founding sponsor, Con Edison. Special thanks to Con Edison and Francis Reshensky for bringing light to this spectacular event. I also want to thank the student choirs who participated and lent their holiday cheer and lovely caroling to this evening. We hope you all have the opportunity to stop by and enjoy the flotilla globe during this holiday season. So, first up for this virtual event, some festive songs by community choir groups. Dashing through the snow in a one horse open sleigh, o'er the fields we go, laughing all the way. Bells on bob to ring, making spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing a sleighing song tonight. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Makes the nations prove the glories of his 
righteousness and wonders of his love and wonders of his love and wonders wonders of his love joy to the world the lord is come let every city her king her king her king her king let every heart prepare him room and heaven and nature sing and heaven and nature sing and heaven and heaven nature sing joy to the world the lord is Let every heart prepare him room, and heaven and nature sing, and heaven and nature sing, and heaven and heaven and nature sing. Sing and nature, heaven and nature, heaven and nature, nature sing. Sing and nature, heaven and nature, heaven and nature, nature sing. Thank you to the Dream Charter School, the Vi Higginson Sing Harlem Choir, the Harlem School of the Arts, and the New Amsterdam Boys and Girls Choir. Up next is the Central Park Conservancy's Staff Holiday Poem. Hello everybody, here's a holiday poem from the Central Park Conservancy. Twas the night before the first snowfall, when all through the park, not a creature was stirring, not a single dog's bark. But Conservancy staff was prepared in Central Park with care in hopes that New Yorkers soon would enjoy their fresh air. The squirrels were nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of acorns danced in their heads. As the flakes started falling, one unique design at time, people could hear the lovely Delacorte clock chime. It rang out from the east side to the west. Winter was here, a season better than the rest. All oh, the sledding, the skating, the cross-country skiing too. Hot chocolate with marshmallows and a visit to the Central Park Zoo. Minute by minute the snow mounted. Then the weather service called to see how many inches we counted. By midnight the last perfect snowflake did land and the staff readied their shovels and loaded their wheelbarrows with sand. With children's hopes at stake, the Conservancy worked through the night so the park would be ready by morning's first light. As the cold New York air made cheeks rosy and red, the children laughed, and through the city, their joy did spread. The Conservancy staff, seeing faces filled with the light, knew they could put down their shovels and finally wish all a good night. That was the Conservancy's take on Twas the Night Before Christmas. Now we're ready to light up the holiday season. Please keep your eye on the Harlem mirror behind me and help us with a countdown. 10, 10 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 